Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying Pep's Draft House Original, the Tap Room Double Pizza. This is actually a one pound, 12.8 ounce pizza, 816 grams. So it's a big pizza. It was $7 at Walmart. Uh, it has shredded mozzarella cheese, sauce, Italian sausage, sliced mozzarella cheese, sliced pepperoni, spicy Italian sausage, diced pepperoni, and provolone cheese. You know what? I honestly thought it was all cheese. I didn't realize it had all that other meat on there. Oh, yeah. It's all under the, yeah, under the cheese. <laughs> it's under the, there's so much cheese on here that yeah. you can't see the Italian sausage or the pepperoni. pepperoni. Or you can see it peeking through here. Yeah, I just never paid attention. Okay, so this one, um, it says baking instructions. Keep pizza frozen prior to baking. Preheat oven to 400 degrees. Remove pizza from packaging and cardboard circle. And place frozen pizza directly on center rack of oven. Bake for approximately 17 to 22 minutes or until cheese is golden brown. Check often as ovens may vary. Remove from oven and place on provided cardboard circle. Product will be hot. Allow to cool before cutting and serving. Product must be cooked thoroughly to 165 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. I think it's so. interesting. This one I, is the first one I've ever heard that says return it to the cardboard tray. I know, yeah, yeah. Because we've always done that, but. Yes, yes, that's, that's how we like to do it. I'm gonna keep this little paper, this paperwork, because we're used to having pizzas in a box. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I'm not used to, um, it just having a it being in the paper like this, but I think that's I mean that's fine. Um, so this is a really good amount of cheese. I think I'll put that right there, and it pretty much stayed on. So I, we are going to bake it for the full 22 minutes. Um, I'm going to set my timer for 22 minutes. If we end up taking it out earlier, I'll tell you. But normally we like ours to get a golden brown. So we had this in the oven the full 22 minutes, and you can see how nice and toasty it got around the edges. We, um, the last pizzas that we've reviewed on the channel have all been thin crust pizzas. So uh, this one, it will be quite different to have uh, something that's just a regular crust. I looked up Pep's uh, Draft House because I had never heard of them. They're uh, out of Green Bay, Wisconsin is where this pizza came from. And I went to their website. It says, I'm not going to try to say their last name because I will butcher it. So I'm just going to say the last name. If you go to the website though, uh, you will see their last name. And this is under the frequently asked questions or something like, or maybe the story, their, their story. Um... Brothers Joseph and Ron bought the Tombstone Tavern in Medford, Wisconsin back in 1962. Adjacent to a cemetery, it was here in the bar's six by six foot kitchen that the original frozen pizza, Tombstone Pizza, was born. Interesting. Because they bought the Tombstone right. Tavern. Yeah. So, that early success was the appetizer for Pep's main course. Years later, he reignited his love for pizza and founded a new venture, Pep's Pizza. His vast kitchen knowledge, use of the finest ingredients, and special sauce had his pizzas once again increasing in demand throughout Wisconsin and beyond. Since Pep's passing in 2013, his legacy lives on with pizza fanatics far and wide. Pep's Pizza Company celebrates that devotion to premium quality pizzas day in and day out. So, I'm sure you're wondering, are they any connection to Tombstone? Tombstone? I don't know. I don't know. No, I'm no, only no. telling you what they told me on the, I don't no, know. Um, well, they mention it, so... They mention it, but there's them. no pictures of Tombstone uh, pizza right. on the website. It's all pizzas that have, look right. like... And let me tell you, I... They look good. My eyes wanted to just like... I, I was scrolling through pizza after pizza. You wouldn't believe how many they have on their really? website. 
I want them all. I want to try <laughs> every. Sweet ones. They even have a taco pizza. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, like taco I pizza. want to try all of them. It's it's just crazy how many they have. But let me tell you, the calories aren't for the faint of heart. <laughs> Well, it's a regular pizza, not a thin crust. I know. I have gotten accustomed to the thin crust. I've gotten spoiled to thin crust calories. This whole pizza. The whole. The whole, whole thing. pizza is 2,160 calories. So for this plate of three pieces, it's 1,080 calories. It is 360 calories for a six. That's a, so, um, that's a lot of calories. That's a lot, a lot of. Uh, it's Pep's Draft House, and it's H-A-U-S dot com. So, uh, if you're interested in visiting, I would suggest you visit the website so you can see everything they have to offer. I wish they shipped, uh, because I would seriously be tempted to, yeah, I would be tempted to buy them because I would love to try, uh, what they have, depending on how this goes. So, but it looks so incredible that it's like, how could it go bad when it looks so great? This looks like something you get out to eat in I a know, restaurant. Really mm. The amount of cheese is like ridiculous. Mm -hmm. You don't see this much cheese on a cheese pizza. And no. this is like a cheese pizza with meat. Yes. So, I mean, it's it's pretty amazing. But like this pizza, as good as it looks, the other ones online look, look better. even better. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. They've got some beautiful looking, <laughs> beautiful looking pizzas. After you get done taking up a couple bites, get a piece of that sausage you eat by itself. Well, I just got pepperoni. Mm -hmm. And I was going to go for a sausage next. The, the, the pepperoni is really nice. The sausage is, is my favorite, though. Oh, boy. It must be that uh, it has some seasoning to it. Huh. <laughs> okay. So, you want me to try it by itself? Can I try it with the crust? You can try it with it. I think the pizza sauce interferes with it a little bit. But they're big hunks mm -hmm. of, like, sausage. Now, the pepperoni are not the great big pepperoni. They're, they're smaller circle or peanut uh, pepperoni. But they have a really good flavor too. That is a very nice sausage. Mm. It um, it does have some seasoning to it, mm -hmm. but it's not spicy. It's not hot. Um, now you can try that piece right there by itself. How would you describe the sauce? Um, it's not. I'm glad it's not a sweet, sweet sauce. Like it's not super sweet, but it's not mm. super savory. It's just a nice tomato sauce. The sausage is good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's very nice. Excellent. Very meaty. I mean, it's almost like you're making uh, almost like breakfast. Sauce. Yeah, this is going to sound um, like I'm um, being negative, but I'm not. It's kind of greasy, like mm -hmm. you would make at home. I mean, that's that's the way sausage is. Sausage mm -hmm. has a little bit of grease in it. That's the way that is. It's no, like, like freshly made. I like the tomatoes. I haven't even tried the crust like here. Mm-hmm. I think it's delicious. Mm -hmm. um, it's amazing to me that they, it is, this experience is like eating, like what you would get out to eat. Mm -hmm. I can't think of any, and we have our favorite pizzas. I can't think of any that are, that we love that give you this same experience, like the out to mm -hmm. eat experience. The bad thing is, they got these in at our local Winchester Walmart, and they sold out fast because... Well, now, it's like they got one box, and that was it. They got, <laughs> yeah, they got one shipment, we went back, they were gone, and we have went back again and again. Mm -hmm. They haven't gotten them back yet, but I did go to the store locator. They do have one on their website. I, it, I'm hoping it's correct because... It gave me two other locations that are close. And are they all Walmarts? Yes, it's all Walmart. Yeah. It's all That's Walmart. That's the only one I searched for. The yeah. only place I ever saw was at Walmart. Yeah, it's all Walmart. So um, you got to go to Walmart to get it. 
Um, so maybe they'll slowly start moving into the where we get more of them. I hope so. I would. I'm yeah. telling you, I will try every well, single one of them if we get them. This is like this is probably moved up to my like top. I know five. Uh huh. <laughs> if not right there, in the top two or three, literally. Which That's is how good bad. It is. Because we can't so many get calories. it. Mm, no, because we can't get it. <laughs> and you can't get it, and it's a lot of calories. Um, it's very, very, very good. The mm -hmm. the cheese, the amount of cheese you get is great. The crust is really nice. It's good and crispy. The sauce is nice. Has a really nice flavor. The yeah, meats it's, are good. The, I like it too that it's not a sweet sauce. Yeah, I don't like a really sweet sauce. Right, but it has a nice uh, seasoning to it. Mm -hmm. Nothing nice hot it. or spicy or anything mm -hmm. like now, that. No, there's nothing on here that's like burn your throat spicy. No. It's got seasoning spice, but not hot spice. Right. Yeah, this... Um, this, really, really good. Yeah, this would be right up there. With, and the price? It was seven bucks. Seven bucks. It was seven bucks uh, at Walmart. Now, I did look up the price for, there's su there supposed to be two different ones from this located in one of the towns close to us. I'm going to, we'll find out. But anyway, they are uh, like $9. Mm -hmm. So I'm wondering if we got this on sale for seven dollars or no, if, I don't know. That one box, couldn't see. Yeah, I have no idea. Yeah. So, but still, this is worth. If they are nine dollars, it's worth nine dollars. I think so too. Yeah, because yeah. we paid twelve or fifteen dollars for a pizza. It seems for some like. that were terrible, that were, was not very good at all. Yes, <laughs> so yeah. this is really good. This this would definitely go in my top um, if I didn't mind uh, spending the calories. If you want a really good uh, like restaurant. Mm -hmm. quality frozen pizza i think you're going to be shocked at how by how yeah, good this really is really good. so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching